What's up, snack casters? What's up, peeps? The dynamic duo is back. Yep. And I'm Scott. Yeah. So I, <laughs> is this a Batman the, and Robin Jerry, thing? Jerry like, and Kevin and Juan Batman? are the dynamic trio. <laughs> so <laughs> welcome back, guys. We are on this uh, motivation um, kick, yeah. Kick, yeah. yeah. And uh, it really pertains to exercise because we went down the diet realm, realm sure. already. Sure. So. so we're wanting today to kind of talk about money. random excuses. Yeah. And today's topic. Today's topic is money. And, you know, it's, it's, it's a big excuse because people often say, I can't join the gym or I can't do this because I don't, don't have, have the right equipment. I don't have the right equipment. Can't afford a trainer. Right. Right. So, you know, they, it's, it's almost like if, once again, I think you said it the other day, was that when I something is important to me, I will find... And this is no different, right? I will find the time. I will f- insert. Period. Program, that, that's not right? a theory. That's a that's right. a rule. When it's important. So when it's important, you'll find the money, right? You'll either find the money. And I say that, but we're going to go into a little t- switcheroo here and also go down the path that maybe it, you don't need money at all. And, you know, I'm sure our shareholders and board of directors, they're <laughs> probably not real happy with that. But my wife would disagree with you. <laughs> <laughs> right, right. The money, money, money. But um, no. So let's, let's start out. I mean, first, the first thing is, is looking at your internal budget, right? I mean, if we always pick on the Starbuckses of the world and the Cafe Latte, La Characa, right. Mocha, Lappuccino. Your 1,400 calorie 1,400 calorie coffee. drink that cost you $8, right? So... When you look into your budget, is it is it important to you? What's more important? Is it is that coffee? Is it? I, I know that's what are all the remember all the all the uh, nonprofit commercials for just one cup of coffee a day. <laughs> but it's it's it's, it's very, true. It's true, right? Like what they're trying to say is, look, into, you got the money. Look into your budget, and if it's important to you, you'll you'll figure it out. If you stop buying the cookies at the store, which is, I mean, you can look at double things, right? If you can stop. Spending money on empty calories, you can maybe put some of that money into exercise. How much do you really need to put into it, though? How much, how much is money really a driver versus an excuse? Do you need um, the $135 Brooks sneakers to start walking? No. No. In fact, I Do you I need would, a gym membership? Right. I would to, go off to, to my kids, right? My kids... All, all kids do this, right? They, Dad, I want to join karate, and I need the $1,000 of equipment. And you would be like, why don't you show up for a week and tell me if you like it before I go out and buy that equipment? So the same thing holds true for us, right, when it comes to fitness, is, like, go out and make sure that you're going to hold yourself accountable before you go buy a Peloton. Yeah. Peloton, don't sue There's me. There's actually, there's a guy <laughs> on Twitter I'd have to look up who he is, but his whole thing is advocating barefoot running, walking. And there's some truth to I that. I think even sells like these little. Uh, I tried to do that. Bottom. But my feet got blistered in like week one. Yeah. yeah. But irregardless, I guess the point being is you don't need the $135 Brooks. You don't. Um, you can even get away with just, well, I mean, my gosh, look at what soldiers have to walk in. Right. And run in. Right. Um, And even physical fitness in general, there are YouTube videos that that are like, you know, just body weight. I remember one of the most prominent uh, football players in college football history was Herschel Walker. Right. And Herschel Walker, his entire college career, I believe, did not work out with weights. I've heard the same. I think he would get up in the morning and do like a thousand squats. It was a it was thousand, 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 wasn't it? Yeah. Push like ups, that, sit up squats. Yeah. And he was he was strong. <laughs> Super. <laughs> Still is. Right. You know, so uh, I think, you know, do you even need the to spend the money? Right. I remember also um, in middle school, I remember our gym teacher did not have the P.E. budget. And you know what he did? He got a metal bar. He attached the chock full of big chock full of nuts cans. You remember those? Coffee. Right? Yeah. He, the big coffee cans. He put cement in them and capped them on both sides. And then those we use for bench press or bicep curls. Right now, maybe cement today with it. You were how old? <laughs> Gosh. Um, eight, ten. 
Nice. Yeah. I like that PE yeah. coach. So, you know, maybe today that's more expensive than the way it's cement is. <laughs> well, you might be right. But, but to the point is that there's probably things around your house that you can pick up. You know what a gallon of water weighs? I have no idea. Eight pounds. Nice. Yeah. So you got two eight-pound dumbbells. Yeah. Just just swinging through the water out. Yeah. I mean, you go buy. What does that cost you at uh, the grocery store? I two don't jugs know. of water. You know, you know, <laughs> it can't you know. be much. Right. So the point here is that is that number one, you probably do have the budget if you were to go in and look at it. Number two, even if you don't have the budget, don't let that be an excuse. Number three, become accountable before you spend money. Like find out if you like it. Now that that doesn't pertain to yes fit races. We want you to do all the yes fit races. <laughs> Self promotion, <laughs> right? Um, but uh, yeah, the next one I think we should go into accountability, and we should talk about ways to be accountable uh, that will keep you motivated. Giddy up! All right, all right. Peace out. Nice work. Yeah, and we did all right. All right. See you guys tomorrow. See you. Peace. <laughs>